often here. Um, today I want to talk a little bit about Google Plus and social networks. Um, I'm not, I don't really understand how these different social networks um, work uh, because there's just so much time involved in, in trying to keep up with all your friends on different networks and what they're saying and so forth and so on. But I still believe that, I mean, everyone is talking about them and using them. So I have to try and figure out how to make them effective. Uh, Google Plus strikes me as quite interesting uh, because of their Hangouts. And so I wish to begin by saying that I'm going to be involved in three Hangouts this weekend. Uh, well, starting Friday night, one in Japanese. So Nihongo no Hangout arimasu no de Vancouver wa no gogo goji desu no de Nihonjikan no ano doyobi no asa no juji hanashi no naiyo wa え、まあ、言葉の、相変わらずですね、言葉の勉強とリンクと、そういうような問題ですけども、ぜひいらしてください。That's the Japanese one. え、ジョンウンド the hangout えよ。え、なしと、え、と呼び、就是、え、星期六。え、我们也要讲关于语言学习和link怎么用link。就是我经常讲的这些题目。so one Japanese, one Chinese, and one very interesting one that's hosted by David Mansore, who is a gentleman that I have communicated with from time to time. I've never met, but he's uh, sort of uh, one of uh, this uh, group that you find on the internet that talks about language learning. And uh, he has invited a number of uh, polyglots to talk about um, how they learn languages, what works for them and, and, and so forth. So you can find information about all three Hangouts at the link page, L-I-N-G-Q, at Google+. And I think in order to uh, be able to participate, you have to uh, include, or you have to, I think, plus one and include, in the case of the link events, link in your circles. And in the case of David's, I think you have to I uh, include David in your circles. I'm not entirely sure how this all works, but I'm sure some of you who are more tech savvy than I am can figure it out. And uh, the way it works is that Google Plus allows you to have up to nine people plus the moderator actually visible on the screen. Uh, but the conference can be broadcast to many, many more people who can also send questions in. And I broadcast mine through YouTube, which I think is the only way because Google owns YouTube uh, that you can broadcast them. And then they become videos, as some of you may be aware, as you've seen that some of the recent uh, Hangouts have ended up as videos on my channel. So that's to let you know that there are these Google Plus Hangouts if you're interested. Um, I think it's, it's amazing. I still can't get over the fact that you can have people from three or four different continents talking around a computer screen and sharing common interest and so forth. I think that's truly, truly wonderful. And I'm sure people will find more and more amazing ways to use this technology. Um, We also started a community, a link community at Google Plus. Again, uh, these are all, from my perspective, experimental. I don't know where this will lead us. Uh, you know, uh, there is a limit to the amount of time you can spend on a computer communicating via computer. Although if you're looking at the person on the screen, it's, it's a, you know, you are communicating. I, I talked to my tutors in Russian today and I'm going to be speaking Russian tomorrow and, uh, check the other day and, and I'm looking at people and we're talking. And so it is, it is amazing really. Uh, I've been working on my Korean as well, and I don't think I'm that far away from uh, being able to start speaking to someone in Korean. If, uh, if any of you want to talk to me in Korean, I, w- I would love to talk to you. That is native speakers, uh, but I prefer to do it via link. So if there are uh, Koreans out there who are studying other languages and want to get on to link and want to offer discussions at link, I will certainly sign up and become your student. So there you have it. That's really all I wanted to say today. Thank you for listening.